Hello foodies! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome to Princess Kitchen page. Please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to follow my page at Princess Kitchen page. Another day, another mini vlog. For today's video, we will recreate the famous spicy chow fan of chow king. Just a disclaimer, this is not the authentic recipe for this. I will just recreate the chow fan of chow king. So here's the ingredients that we will need. We have garlic, onion, carrots, ground beef or pork, eggs, leftover rice, oyster sauce, liquid seasoning, salt and pepper to taste, and MSG. So for the toppings, I will just use Pampanga's Best Lumpiang Shanghai. And for extra spice, I will use Gourmet Creation Chili Garlic Oil. So kung ready ka na, mag-start na tayo magluto. In a pan, just heat your oil and add your eggs. So scrambled egg lang yung gagawin ko dito. Mamaya ilalagay ko lang to sa ating fried rice. Kapag okay na yung egg, just set aside. In a pan, just heat some oil. mag start naman tayo mag ngayon. So, unahin natin yung bawang. Isahin lang natin to hanggang sa lumabas yung aroma ng bawang. Next, ilalagay natin yung ating onion. Kapag translucent na yung onion natin, pwede na natin i-add yung ground beef or ground pork. Depende sa inyo kung ano yung gusto nyo gamitin na meat. After natin siya mag-isa, timplahan lang natin ang salt and pepper. Then now we can add our carrots. Igisa lang natin yung carrots natin for at least 1 to 2 minutes kasi medyo matigas yung ating carrots. So make sure lang na hihiwain nyo siya ng maliligo. After nyan, kapag medyo malambot na yung carrots natin, pwede na natin ilagay yung ating kangkong. Yung stem muna yung inuna ko kasi ito yung matigas na part. Kapag medyo lumambot na yung ating kangkong stem, we can now add the leaves. Igisa lang natin siya ulit for at least 1 to 3 minutes. Ngayon medyo half cook na yung ating kangkong. We can now add our day old rice. Haluin lang natin siya ng maigi para mag-combine yung lahat ng ingredients natin. Yung ginamit ko pala dito is hindi siya day-old rice pero much better kung day-old rice para mas maging hug-hug siya. Ngayon, titimplahan na natin siya ng liquid seasoning. Yung ginamit ko dito is yung hot chili pero kung wala naman kayo nun, okay lang yung normal. After that, naglagay na ako ng oyster sauce and naglagay na rin ako ng gourmet creation chili garlic oil para maging mas maanghang yung ating fried rice. Hindi ko pala napakita sa video pero nilagay ko na yung ating sinet aside na egg and nagsison na rin ako ng MSG. So yung gagamitin kong toppings is yung Pampanga's Best Lumpiang Shanghai pero depende na sa inyo kung ano yung gusto nyo i-partner sa ating fried rice. So, ayan, nagpainit lang ako ng oil, tapos pinrito ko na rin yung ating lumpiang Shanghai. Kapag medyo nag-brown na siya, pwede na natin siyang balik na rin. So, ayan, after nyan, plating na tayo. Ito yung ating fried rice in Shanghai. Hinagay ko lang siya sa Tupperware kasi ibibigay ko to sa aking friend. So, ayan na yung finished product. This is spicy chow pan inspired by chow ki. 
perfecto partnera ng Toyo Mansi na may chili garlic oil. So, this will be the end of our video. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And please hit the notification below para updated ka sa ating next video. Bye!